hi guys welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video so today i am so excited to announce that i have officially opened my own etsy shop and my own little artwork instagram so for a really long time i have always wanted to get into drawing more graphic design stuff just a lot more being able to be creative um not on like a laptop where you have to like drag and drop things and sort of just be able to do your own thing and I got myself a new iPad and an Apple Pencil during this quarantine so you know that I just had to start doodling and getting on Procreate and all of the things that everyone has been doing on TikTok. You guys know what I'm talking about. But that is my little update and I'm very, very excited about it. Um, but if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, leave some comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So story time. So throughout quarantine, I bet all of you guys know that everyone had been really bored, not knowing what to do. You can only do the same things over and over so, so many times, right? So throughout quarantine, I had spent a lot of time on TikTok and I had somehow, some way, found myself on like artist TikTok and people were showing videos of themselves doing little cool designs and doodles on procreate and so i had never known what procreate was until i saw these videos on tiktok and so basically procreate is an app that you can get on an ipad and you all you need is just an apple pencil and an ipad and some creative juices and all you have to do is just start drawing on there and i was so amazed by all these people's like cool artwork and then also with me being obsessed with Animal Crossing during the quarantine. Literally, I had joined a bunch of different Facebook groups and different Animal Crossing things because I was just so obsessed and I still am to this day. Um, so with that, I joined this group called like Animal Crossing Art and Codes. And so you can basically get different design codes and put it on your island um and so i joined that and then also within that i didn't know that people actually did different animal crossing art and so i saw so many people's cool like animal crossing stickers commissioned artwork that they like drew of other people's animal crossing characters with their favorite like villagers and i thought that that was so cool and i was like wow i i want to do that like that's pretty cool and so after like months of me debating on if I should spend my money on an iPad and an Apple Pencil because it's not cheap. Um, I definitely had to contemplate a lot of things, <laughs> um, but thankfully your girl finally got her unemployment money at like the end of June when I literally applied for it in March. My tanning salon that I worked at closed for two months and I never got any of the money because it never like processed and I was like, I'm never getting the money and I basically came to the terms that I would never get it but I finally got my money and it was like way more than I thought that I was gonna get and so I was like I'm gonna get the iPad yeah that's my reasoning behind that and so I finally got it and so I got the 256 gigabyte iPad Air I never did an unboxing because I felt like there's not really much to unbox with this it's literally like just the iPad I feel like everyone knows what an iPad looks like don't really need a whole video on it so I got this it's really lightweight um, the one that I also got is the rose gold color um, and this is the cover that I currently have on it so it's pretty much the same color but you can sort of see like the actual color um underneath i don't feel like taking the whole cover off right now but the ipad air this is the only one that comes in the rose gold um my boyfriend just got the ipad pro he's starting medical school so he wanted the fancy one um so i get to play around with that sometimes but he got the ipad pro i got the ipad air which i thought was just perfect for what i needed which is just like content creation creating different 
artwork and then also like maybe doing new thumbnails on YouTube, Instagram stuff, editing, all that. So an iPad Air was perfect for me and then I of course got an Apple Pencil as well. And so this is the first generation Apple Pencil. Um, this is good with an iPad Air. Um, the second generation Apple Pencil is only good with the most recent iPad Pro. So again, my boyfriend has that one and it's pretty cool. Um, that one like is pretty fancy but this one's pretty good for me as well but basically um i started looking at different youtube tutorials of how to use procreate because when i first opened it up i didn't really know a lot of the tricks and hacks that they're because procreate is so so fancy right um so there were so many things that i needed to learn so many things that i had no idea like how things worked so i watched a lot of procreate tutorials a lot of procreate tiktoks um they always just come up on my for you page anyways so i always just like them and then watch them later um so a lot of them are on my tiktok if you guys want to see those just like type in procreate on like search and then once you watch a few of those they'll be all over your for you page um but that's how i sort of learned a lot of things about procreate um but i wanted to create a little instagram of my artwork and then also eventually i'm going to be selling stickers so i do have to sort of plan that out because that's a lot of stuff that i'm gonna need um but right now i just opened my etsy shop the other day so i have one listing so far so if you guys want to give me some love some support and want to go check it out i will have the link to my etsy shop in the description below um but i do have one listing and it is for a customized illustration that i can draw of you and your friends of just yourself if you need a new profile picture for Instagram, for YouTube, anything. Um, if you want a picture drawn of like your family, anything, hit me up. And I can even give a little YouTube discount as well. And I will put that in the description too. So make sure you guys go head over to my Etsy shop and then also my new Instagram account. I have named my business too which is crazy um but the naming part was very difficult because i myself am a very indecisive person um so it took a lot of trial and error with figuring out what i wanted to name it i put up like an instagram poll didn't really get a lot of ideas um some people were like emily my inch designs which basic um and i wanted something cool i wanted something that was different um i wanted i also wanted something that was like trendy you know um i always see so many people's like artwork accounts and businesses are like such trendy names and i was like oh, i want something like that so without further ado i wanted to announce my business name too which is so fun um so my etsy shop and instagram is titled poppy print collective and so i will be mostly doing like hand lettering graphic design and then also those commissioned art prints too um i love just drawing and i'm excited to just venture out and see what kind of artwork my brain comes up with um so i'm super excited about that and then i've also been planning a few stickers that i will have in my etsy store eventually um i just need to purchase like a cricket um if i want to do like the certain specific type of sticker paper um i need to purchase those things and then also purchasing packaging um is really important i've seen a lot of tiktoks about those um like purchasing like thank you cards and designing those and then also getting like mailers and like label printers and stickers for your packaging and all of that so i need to do a detailed plan of that before i even start um thinking about all of that so i need to do that that is definitely on my to-do list but let me just show you guys a few of my things it's very exciting i've only been doing this for a few weeks now too um so obviously it's not like the most amazing artwork but i think it's pretty cool um so don't be too harsh on me you guys i'm just trying so this is what procreate looks like if you guys can see it so 
basically you can just add your own artwork and do everything and I just have like a few doodles here and there but I've been having so much fun and I will like include little snippets of artwork in this video so you guys can see a better view or just go to the Instagram and then you can go see it there as well but like I said with like commissioned artwork this is like what's listed on my Etsy right now so pictures like this that I can make for you guys um literally any kind of picture as long as it's high quality and I'm able to like see it then I can make um so that was one of my favorites that I did of me and my friends and then I did this one of me and my boyfriend and this was from if this will focus and this was from a trip from Disney so if you guys want Disney pictures recreated always doing that as well and also did this for one of my best friends she asked me if I could do a picture of her and her boyfriend so this one is super cute but I just love doing drawings like that and then also I've been doing different like sticker designs so like this one I just did the other day and so it would be like if this wants to focus it literally looks like a big white circle okay so like this <laughs> um would be a sticker so I'm just trying to do like trendy cute stickers um obviously it's sort of like my thing um and like things like this like you know what I mean like cute trendy stickers that you guys can put on your laptops and your hydro flasks um just things of that nature rainbows butterflies all that um and then people also asked me too if I could make stickers for like Disney um Disney college program specifically a lot of people followed me on YouTube because of my DCP video so I will definitely try and do some DCP stickers um but yeah that is that and then I wanted to show you guys my Instagram account too that I now have and so you guys can find my new Instagram um, it's literally just at poppy print collective um, and it will just say like welcome custom art prints by me at Emily Mayant um, so this is what I have so far I literally just started this like two days ago um, so it's a work in progress for sure I literally just have one highlight but this is what I have obviously I'm just trying to be trendy you know um, and right now I'm trying to post at least once a day I've been doing like two posts a day just so I could like have stuff in my feed because I don't like it looking empty but I've only had this account for like two like two days and already almost at 100 followers which is like really exciting um which is something that's very weird to be excited about but make sure you guys follow me on my instagram um i'll be posting like all updates about etsy stuff and also like different artwork on there too and then also on this instagram that's where you guys can dm me about like etsy and art stuff um it's sort of hard for me to go through my messages on my main account just because i do get a lot of messages on there um so it would be easiest for you to dm me on my art one if you guys are looking for a commissioned piece or literally anything if you guys have ideas for stickers or suggestions for anything um dms are always open for my art instagram but that is that i'm like really excited um i'm gonna start looking into different packaging and things of that nature for stickers and also looking into getting a cricket and all of that good stuff as well um so if you guys have suggestions for me hit me up because it's a lot of things and i'm trying to make this something where potentially i could be doing like maybe full time i know a girl can only dream um but it would literally be the dream if my full-time income could be from youtube and like etsy right like that would be like amazing um so i'm hoping that that could be a thing in the future but 
I'm really excited to be announcing this on my channel. I announced it on my Instagram the other day and got so much support and love from there. Um, so I'm excited to announce it here too because um, I know my audiences on both Instagram and YouTube are a little different. So I'm excited for you guys to check it out. Um, and again, I will be posting new sticker designs on my Instagram. So don't forget to follow at Poppy Print Collective again just you know self promo everywhere um but i'm really excited to start this new etsy journey um i know i'm gonna have so many things that i'm gonna have to learn and a lot of bumps in the road that will probably come up soon literally just started like two days ago so who am i um but i'm really excited and again i will put the links for everything down in the description below for you guys to check out and i'll also be putting it all in my all of my upcoming videos because but I'm super, super, super excited. And hopefully maybe in the future, I might even sell some other things too. I have just like so many ideas and so many things that I wanna do. So hopefully it will just grow from here. And I'm really excited to see the next steps in this journey of being a small business owner, I guess we could say that. I don't even know. Um, but yeah, that is that update and announcement and I'm so super excited. Um, so if you guys want to get updates on my Etsy shop and Instagram, make sure you go ahead and follow. Um, go head over to my Etsy shop, heart it. Um, so Etsy gives me some love. Um, so I'm very excited about that. But yeah, that is all I have to say about that little announcement. Um, so if you guys liked this video, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and then leave some comments down below for me. If you are a small business owner, if you have an Etsy shop or even specifically stickers, give me some advice, please. Um, I'd love any suggestions, anything that helped you when you were starting out, literally anything at all. Or if you're in my shoes and you just started your small business, let me know in the comments so we can go ahead and support each other. I love supporting other people who are in the same boat as me. It's always so much fun to see each other grow, um, especially when we're all just trying to thrive and be our best selves. Um, and then don't forget to follow me on my Instagram. My main is at Emily Mayant, and then my new art Instagram is at Poppy Print Collective. So don't forget to follow me on both of those accounts. And then lastly, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, and you guys will be seeing more Etsy updates for sure, and just more updates in general. Um, I will be trying to just make a journey of my small business on my youtube so don't forget to subscribe um but that is literally it for today's video i hope you guys liked it and i will see you guys next time bye